Okay, Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Good day again everyone. Today we will be discussing about operations on functions and composition on functions. Okay, so firstly let's have operations on functions. So you may uh, you may ask na ano na uh, ano ba yung operations natin on functions? That would be basic lang, which is of course yung apat: the addition, subtraction, multiplication, and division. Now, how do we even add functions? So, let's uh, take a look at this example. So, this is how we add functions. Uh, say, we have f plus g of x. Yeah. So, if we have f of g of x, I, for a while, sorry, let me have our given um, default functions muna. Say, our f of x is equals to um, x plus 1, and our g of x is equals to x squared minus 2x plus 5. And our h of x is equals to um, 2x minus 3. Yeah. Uh, 2x squared minus 3. Yeah, let's, just, let's have q. Yeah. So we have this given. Okay. And maybe let's say a, b, c, d, e, f, g, h, i. So say we have i of x. Okay. Say we have um, 3x minus 4. Yeah. So yeah. So if we have um, an addition of, um, of function, for example, we have f sorry, f plus uh, h of x. So, what would happen here is I will just simply take f and I will simply take h and I will add the givens here. Ito, tsaka, ayan. I will add them together. And that would be parenthesis x plus 1 plus parenthesis 2x cubed minus 3. That's it. And that is how you add functions. I-add mo lang siya technically. So, I mean, yeah, yeah, you just simply add. For example, I have again um, g plus h of x. So, again, I will take g, which is of course x squared minus 2x plus 5, parenthesis, just to be sure, plus h, which is of course 2x cubed minus 3. Okay? The same goes if you would have be having anything complicated like say um, uh, g minus h plus i minus f of x you will just simply copy them and of course um, sulat mo lang ano ba yung operations between them so of course we have g first so we will have equals dito tayo sa baba x squared minus 2x plus 5 parenthesis minus h is 2x cubed minus 3 plus i which is of course um, parenthesis 3x minus 4 minus f which is of course x plus 1 ganun lang you just simply have to copy them together. And this would be applicable for any operation that you can think of. For example, I have g, h. When we have g, h, we have to multiply them together. Kasi again, by default, if letters are beside each other, we are multiplying them. g and h, so we have x squared, sorry, minus 2x plus 5, parenthesis times h. Ang h natin is 2x cubed minus Multiplication. Same goes if we will be trying to divide. So, say we have um, i over h x of x. i over h of x. So, our i is of course 3x minus 4, parenthesis paren. All over, our h is x plus 1. We divide them. That's it. That's it. And, again, let's maybe, let's have something complicated. A combination of multiplication and division. And let's say addition na rin. We have g h of h minus i. Yan. Of x. So, the same goes. We copy g. Anong g natin ay x squared minus 2x plus 5. Multiply natin dun sa h. Our h is 2x cubed minus 3. All over. Our h is of course x plus 1. Parenthesis. And our i would be minus i would be um, 3x minus 4. So you will notice they are the same. Ito yung g. Ito yung h. Is this h as well? Wait lang. G, h, h. Dalawa pala yung h natin. So in this case, ito pala ay magiging um, 2x cubed minus 3. Yan. In any case, the same h. And then we have i. Or maybe let's change this, let's change this one na lang. Yung ating given na lang. Ito, palitan na lang natin ito na, um, that would be F, I guess. Yeah, let's have F. 
Yan, this is F and this is I. Okay? So, even if you would have this complicated um, operation, again, ang ginagawa lang naman natin is we just simply write them together. Okay? Sinusulat lang natin siya. Because there would be cases that you will be asked to say, um, have, say we have G plus H of 0. Yan. G of H of 0. So, we will copy G. Ang G natin is, of course, X squared minus 2X plus 5. Ang H natin is just simply 2x cubed minus 3. Ang kaso, the only case here is that we have of 0. So, meaning the x should be 0. So, it's, it's the same as what we have discussed before. All the values here of x would become 0. Gawin natin bracket na kasi, ayan. Minus 2 times 0 plus 5 bracket plus bracket 2 times 0 cube minus 3 bracket. And then what do we need to do? We simply need to evaluate. 0, 0, positive 5. We have 5 here. Plus 0 times 2, 0, plus negative 3. And it will ultimately give us positive 2. Okay? And this is just how we solve ano, um, the operations on functions. You will be sometimes be given this one. Yeah. So, what would be the answer if that would be 0? Oh, another one. What if it is 1? We have G plus H of 1. So, this would be, bracket ulit tayo, 1 squared minus 2 times 1 plus 5 bracket plus bracket 2 times 1 cubed minus 3 bracket. You might ask, bakit bracket po? Kasi diba remember, my rule when it comes to substitution, lagyan nyo ng bracket ay ng parenthesis. And since we have multiple parenthesis na, we use the next level of grouping, which is of course yung bracket. Okay? So, solving this one, 1 this is negative 2 plus 5, and this would be 1 times 2, it's 2 and 2 minus 3, the answer is negative 1. This is 1 minus 2, it's negative 1, plus 5, the answer is 4, plus negative 1, it will give us positive 3. Okay? And that would be operations on functions. Okay? And also solving as well ng operations on functions. Okay? So, on the next video, we will continue with the, um, what call, the composition of functions. Okay? So, if you would have any other questions regarding this uh, topic, the operations on functions, you can um, view the video again or chat me in our group. Thank you everyone and assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.